guys, I got a request to teach you guys how to make a beat. And basically, let's just get to it. The first thing I want to say is um, I'm using FF Studio as a demonstration because it's like the only thing that really is going to be quick and easy to show you guys. So the first thing I want to teach you guys is about like, you know, I guess, melodies, I guess. So I just picked the piano. Alright, um, you got to learn what sounds good and what doesn't. So first thing you know, on your keyboard you should see Q, W, E, R, T, Y. All these notes are going to sound good because they're on the same scale. Whites sound good with whites and blacks sound good with blacks if you're just starting off. So I would always advise you to go and do like one, two, two, three, four. I would always advise you to do that. You know what I'm saying? Then select them all. Hold down shift and slide it over. Slide it over. So you basically got a four bar, you know what I'm saying, measure, which is easy. So now you play it, you got. All right, so that's, that's, that's something simple. And then you might want to go to a lower note. And then just make it, you know, just make it wider. I'm sorry, guys, I just woke up and I'm just showing you, like, all right, so let's see how this sounds. All right, that's just basically, that's just basic, something basic. All right, so I'm using the defaults. I don't like none of those. But I guess I could work with six. So, I'm going to go on the piano row. And everything normally goes on a, on a third measure right here. Everything normally goes right here. I don't know why, but it just normally does. Alright, so... So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take this, hold down shift once again, drag it over,
right, so basically I did the snares or whatever. And, uh, you know, that's what you should, like, just fill out for that. All right, next thing that normally typically goes in a beat is some hi-hats, which is, which, come up with a rhythm for your hi-hats. Don't just do it the simple way. Where, like, you just going to be like, oh, okay, let me just do something like that. You know what I'm saying? Just come up with a rhythm. Something that feels right to you. If it don't feel right to you, then chances are it's not right. And I'm just being random with them. So I'm feeling how that sounds, you know. Alright, so you got you got your dope little loop right there. So let me go into these keys real quick. I ain't really, I ain't really feeling these keys at all. So I'm gonna go ahead and drag that to FX5. Double click on that real quick, real quick. I ain't even gonna play with it. Um, I'm probably gonna put in some fruity love filter. Just, 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 just off the simple fact that I wanted to have sort of like a Drake sort of sound. So. So I added in some hardcore just to do something I like to do to it. So now what I'm finna add is, is I'm finna add in some boo bass, boo bass, I'm sorry. Like I said, I'm sleepy. I'm turning the bass up. I'm turning the mid down. I'm turning the treble down because I wanted to have a... Put that on effect six. And I'm gonna put some distortion on this. You know. All right, 
Zeit. Ähm, so basically, I'm just gonna use this to carry out the notes. So like, bass, bass, because I know where all the notes are, so it's a lot easier to do this. Um, you know, sometimes you might want to like, sometimes you might want to like switch it up. It all depends, but I have a feeling I'm gonna like that, so I'm just gonna, you know. We're going to scoot that to the second half of the track, just so it's different. And it's not the same. Just on one pattern. So that's normally what you got like for um for like a uh for just a basic beat. Bring me to bring me to fake me baby. Fake me fake me fake fake me. <laughs> oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Now for a break. You think that you think that was what's this knob? Right now. Right now. Right, right now. Right now. Right now. Bip 
trap beat it's all the same template the only thing different is like different tricks like for example with the hi-hats you know how these hats are slow and trap basically you'll do some trap hats which I'll show you now which trap hats are simply this trap hats aren't hard they're called trap hats for a reason, because they're trapped in their hats. You, you know, trap hats. So, let me grab my selector tool. Let me go back to this because stuff likes to act stupid. So, basically, a trap hat is just literally exactly what you see me do. That's the trap hat. Now, the same thing goes with the trap snare. There is nothing new, you guys. There is nothing new at all. So let me take these two out. And let me just simply do like this. Draw four of them, boys. And then, let's say, for example... Okay, let me use my selector. Let me select all these. Let me go back to my little tool I was using. And then let me go bring that like right there. You know what I'm saying? And then what they like to do is towards the end, they like to drop it, to drop the notes or something like that. And it, it just it just comes out decent. Let me give it that one. <laughs> Alright, and that's basically, you know, that's basically what they do, and then, you know what I'm saying, some people like that copy this, they go edit, they click copy real quick, they copy it, and then they paste it on a new channel, which is something I do, so and then I'll go into insert, I'll click something like harmless, just real quick. <laughs> And what I would do is, I would go into FL Studio, select all of them, I would go down Tools, I would click Appreciate, and click Accept, you know what I'm saying, and just basically, and just basically, I put it on the wrong track, hold on, and I basically play it out. Bye. 
First thing I started off with was the keys. So then I added the snares, then hi hats, then followed by a kick, followed by a bass, and then I I added a sample. So. That's where this comes from, because I like to add samples to stuff, just. Then I like to double stuff and appreciate it, so that way you get an appreciated version of your original rhythm. So nothing's off key, everything's on key, just appreciate it, so it's like. And that's, that's literally all you do to make like a hip-hop beat slash rap beat. 